as seeing was, was the problem individual errors or systems failure or a mixture of both? Um, well, I think we did. We didn't play as well as as well as we would have wanted to play for sure. It was a, you know, Greece Greek, Greece were about much better side in the first half overall. Um, they had they had a lot of control, more than we would have wanted. They played well, but really, um, that can happen away from home um, for international teams throughout. But you've got to defend better than we did, and you've got to see it out. And we didn't do that, and that's what that's what hurt us in the end. Um, we got back into the game well with a well worked goal, um, and one all one all at half time. We, we tactically changed it, and and you know that would have allowed us to play with more control three four two one, and it did. Uh, in the second half, allow us to play with more control, but we can't take any credit for that because certainly that would you have to take into account that Greece would have dropped off a little bit after scoring. So, um, they uh, it was just a, a really poor second goal to give away. I can't believe we gave it away, and you know, to be honest, and um, we got punished for that. So, uh, that that's hurt us because. Um so that's that's that that's uh, the reasons, you know, that's it. Damien Swan, please. Stephen, this always looked a really tough group to qualify from. Does does this result make it near impossible? It's only the second game and we've made life we've given ourselves a mountain climb all right, it's only the second game, but we could just at the moment we've just gotta get ourselves ready for for Monday. Yeah, we'll be home game nearly full stadium. Yeah, people want to support the team, we need to give them uh, a, a victory on Monday, and that's what we've got to focus on. And Lee. Stephen, uh, how are you doing? Um, just judging by the team that started tonight, it, was, it seemed that there was some very close calls there to make in terms of starting 11. Um, any, any regrets on, on the, the thing you put out? You know, it can be argued that was, um a lot of inexperience in the team that can be argued you know I have to accept that um, but no uh, it's easy it's easy after the event if someone makes a mistake to say you should just play the other player or whatever but I think um, it's you know uh, I feel uh, I feel even though you know our performance wasn't at the level we would have wanted we were still right in the game right right till the 95th minute um, and had chances to equalise, you know, had chances to equalise. Obviously, Nathan shot, Matt shot, a lot of crosses across the box, a lot of corner kicks, and we had a lot of pressure, um, but not loads of clear-cut chances. Um, and, you know, we were still in the game right at the end and could have could have drawn the game, but it, it, it might have flattered us a bit. But I think, um, we, we you know, the players never go up and... It's just very disappointed with sending off at the end. Um, it seems extremely harsh. Matt's got involved. To, to you know to try and pull people out of it, but he, he's not he's not touched anyone's face at all. It's just pushed someone in, you know and it's not someone in the chest in in the chest to get someone out of the way, and it's uh, too much has been made of it. He's gone down like and there's no 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 facial contact or anything like that. Gavin Cominsky, please, and then mm. Philip Quinn, and then we'll end the live section. And Stephen, uh, Adam Eda, Russell Hull, and Calvo down and gone by 53 minutes. Um, is that, was that, is that, and I don't know, was the tactics not working out or strategy not working out? Because obviously Plan A was a very attacking team and it did go badly wrong. Well, you know, it was one, it was one all at half time, but we needed to establish more control in the game. And, uh, you know, I don't, it was just, Obviously, we got punished for the mistakes that we made. Um, so we're disappointed to lose the game. I think uh, I take responsibility as manager for that. You know, I think uh, obviously um, that's that's the reality. You know, I do take responsibility for you know a game that we would have wanted to to, to you know certainly enough to lose and. Um, 
Yeah, so just like that goal after half time absolutely shifted the, the balance of the game again and more or less the first attack. So you know, we're absolutely kicking ourselves with that. We'll have one more from Philip in the live section and then have a short Sunday sections because Gus is obviously waiting. Yeah. Okay. Um, um, on RGE, um, Stephen Dean Brady said in a quote here that um, this is the worst group of players any Irish manager has had in my lifetime. How would you respond to that? You know, I don't, I don't, I don't really want to respond to any anyone else's uh, comments. You know, people are entitled to their opinion. But we've showed in other games, the players have showed a lot of good performances. But we, the issue is the moment that we come come out the wrong side of tight games. So that wasn't it today. We were Greece were better overall than us in the match today, uh, which some of the other games have been very very tight defeats, but. Um, I don't. Uh, I don't. I don't. I don't think that's the case. Um, I think. I think um, we're disappointed with tonight. There's no doubt about that. Okay. Then the entry from this one on into Zimbabwe at 11 p.m. on Saturday.